Hey, what's up, everybody? So, I just got back from Florida after just having gotten back from Vancouver, Canada, and I thought it was time to show you guys a little bit of the behind the scenes in terms of what I do and some of the uh, behind the scenes work. It's not really a day in the life because it's not what I do every single day, and um, but it is a day in the life slash behind the scenes because this is the kind of stuff I'm always doing. Um, so basically I got back from Vancouver with uh, at Drumeo and I had about two hours to load up my stuff, wash my clothes, get packed again, and then basically head out for Florida. And so then I was in Florida for the pretty much the past week. I uh, shot some videos with Emil and Daryl and Anna uh, Centina, the bassist who you've seen in some of my other videos. So had a lot of fun there. But I just got home from Florida, a uh, six hour drive from my mom's house. I stopped by there and about nine hours overall and I had my car loaded up like you see now and so I'm about to unload my car in order to set up a drum set in my studio to record some videos on switch out two drum sets load up another drum set in here and set up all my recording gear and lighting gear and backdrop and everything that I took down to Florida so here's a little look at how busy it can be being a gigging drummer who also makes YouTube videos and does video shoots and all that fun stuff so Let's go!
Alright guys, so that is a little bit of a behind the scenes look at just a normal kind of switch out setup day where I'm coming back from a video shoot or coming back from a gig. I gotta load in a drum set, I gotta clean up the room, I gotta change out the kits, I gotta set lights back up, I gotta set everything back up. Um, today has been pretty long, I don't know if I look tired, but I am very tired because I started at 4 a.m. this morning. That's what time I woke up and drove back this way so I could get started on this weekend of stuff. Um, today's Friday, then I've got Saturday and Sunday, and then I leave on Monday bright and early for a camp in Kentucky. And so for these few days I have to um, learn 12 songs, I had to get that kit set back up, record something, edit it, um, record and edit, well not record, but edit a lot of other videos, um, and also uh, clean this stuff up and, and do a few other things and go to church and uh, try and spend some time with some family before I'm gone again. So it's, it's, been, a, uh, it's been a long couple of weeks and uh, it's going to be a, a long busy weekend and then a, hopefully a fun four days at the camp going to be way out in like the, almost the wilderness or something so it, it should be interesting uh, definitely bringing my cameras along for that um, if you can tell I'm not even done yet there's still stuff everywhere so that like three hours of setup you just saw isn't even all of it I still have more to do and there's still more to do in there next I have to take that kit over there the black export kit and find a way to make it as small as possible so I can fit it in a car, hopefully with four other, or three other people, a guitar amp, four guitars, and suitcases so we can all ride together up to this camp in Kentucky and save some gas money and uh, have a good time. So, so uh, it's going to be interesting, but thank you so much for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, the music you heard in the background was actually me playing along to some Drumeo drumless tracks from my live lesson. Uh, you can check out that live lesson, it's how to learn songs quickly and it actually has a lot to do with what I'm doing this weekend because I'm learning 12 songs in like two days. So um, I'm using the same exact method that I used in that video. So you can check that out if you like. Thanks again for watching, have a good one, and subscribe for more videos. Peace.